of people, when they look at your later works, they look at it you know, as sort of depicting creation, the cosmos, the universe, and the energy behind it. What do you say? I definitely believe in energy. And I think that the tension which is created through the lines and colors in my works, they depict, for example, it's not that one particular dot I can explain, but it's the totality of the work, total feeling of that work. And I see the whole surface. I don't say that this has this meaning or that has that many. You have to see the in totality and feel it. But a lot of people, a lot of critics, even, even when I look at your works, frankly, the first thing that comes to my mind is, energy, creation, the cosmos. Absolutely. Is that a legitimate yes. way of looking at Absolutely. It means you are yeah. looking at them quite seriously. And you know what adds to that feeling, Sajat, is the fact that you also in your works use Sanskrit verses and Om. Now, Om is supposed to be the sound of the universe. It represents all of creation. So it gives that feeling it's a of first the creation, sound. the it's, cosmos. It's absolutely. It's a first sound. And when I use this Sanskrit text, yeah. I feel for me it has a couple of different dimensions. One, it's like a space for me, like the way I'm using my red and orange, of course. It's a part of my work. Secondly, it's a continuity for me from my past to my present, which will move to future. It's a continuity of my tradition. And at the same time, uh -huh. all the collages which I have used, these are, these are old manuscripts, old text from Gita or Veda or some from Rigve, uh, some from Naneshwari, some Modi Lipi, small Modi Lipi also I have used. So they carry a lot of vitality and a lot of positive meaning to that. Uh, so you try to give positive energy to your work yes, exactly. through I don't, those verses. Absolutely. And I don't yeah. think you need to read them. Just the presence. Yeah. It's just the vibration. Yeah, but I've also noticed that you know, your Sanskrit verses, even the Om, is coming either, you know, you can look at it sort of normally, face front, or it's coming upside down, or it's coming sideways. You know, in other words, you can almost look at your paintings from any angle, yes. just like the cosmos. Yes, and the Om series, of course, the works I'm doing nowadays, you will not see Om directly, uh -huh. but there is maybe the sound of Om which exists there.